Good evening, I'm Alex Stierkman. DePaul University and Wabash College announced today they are opposing an amendment that would change the state's constitution to define marriage as between a man and a woman. They joined Cummins, Eli Lilly, and Indiana University as members of Freedom Indiana, a bipartisan coalition created to oppose the measure. Toyota is moving its material handling's North American headquarters to Columbus. Operations will be housed in an existing plant there. The move is creating 50 jobs and represents an investment of just more than $4.5 million. Governor Mike Pence was on hand for today's ribbon cutting. He calls the move a testimony to the Indiana and Japan's strengthening relationship. Toyota President Jeff Rufner says the move to Indiana from California is part of a plan to align marketing, sales and manufacturing teams in a centralized location closer to key markets and customers. Half of Indiana's children younger than nine years old are living in low-income households, up from 43 percent in 2005. That's according to data released today by the Annie E. Casey Foundation's Kids Count. The report looked at children from birth to eight years old, making a case for more, than, for more investment in early childhood development. The report also shows only 30 percent of low-income children in Indiana go to some kind of preschool, compared to nearly 50 percent of higher-income children. State officials say they recognize the need for more investment in early education programs. The legislature last session created a committee for recommending early education initiatives to the legislature, but it did not pass a bill that would have created a pre-K pilot program. And Indiana is one of only a handful of states that does not fund preschool. And here's a look at the weather. Tonight will be mostly cloudy, 46 degrees as the low. Tomorrow, a 30 percent chance of rain. Showers in the evening, 61 degrees as the high. And here's a look at the five-day forecast. Wednesday, expect a 90 percent chance of rain, 61 degrees as the high, 38 degrees as the low. For more on these stories and other local news, go to indianapublicmedia.org.